Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. In this video, I will show you one design trick that will take your line charts to the next level. Imagine being able to automatically display red arrows when the value in your line chart is going down or it is below a certain target and green arrows when the value is going up or it's above target. Something that looks like this. And this functionality will enable your end users to easily identify important changes. So enough of talking and let's get started. And here we are in our Power BI test file where we already have a line chart with conditionally formatted markers. Uh, in the previous video, I showed you how to format those markers. If you missed it, I will leave a link in the description so you can uh, watch it later. And today we are going to take this line chart a step further and add arrows to our markers. To create arrows, we need one simple DAX measure that we are going to create now. So let's navigate to our measures table and select new measure. Let's name this measure arrows. Now let's create first variable that will be arrow up and to create arrow up we will use unichar function input for this function is a number that we will find on one great resource that i'm using often and that is vertex42.com where we have a bunch of useful shapes symbols that you can use within unichar function so arrow up i will use this code 9650 let me copy this and paste it within the function close parentheses and let's create second variable for arrow down let's use same function let's open vertex page and let's select arrow down so there it is 9660 copy Paste it, close parentheses, and now let's define a rule. So if value in line chart, and that is total revenue in our case, is higher than $3,500, so this is our target, you can set any other value or any other function. So if it's higher than $3,500, then we want to see arrow up. If it's not, then other results will be arrow down. Let's close parentheses, enter. So select line chart, open format pane and scroll down until data labels and turn on data labels. And now we have data labels. You can leave them, but I will turn them off later. So expand data labels, scroll down and let's turn off value and let's expand details. So in data we will add arrows that we have created. Close this and now as you can see arrows have been added and now we just need to format them. So, go to color, conditional formatting, let's select rule, rule will be based on total revenue, if revenue is higher than 3500, set this to number, and less than maximum, arrow will be green. And let's add a new rule, if value is higher than minimum value, change this to number, and less than 3500 then arrow will be that and press ok and now as you can see arrows have been formatted and done that's it now you know how to add arrows to your line chart and make your report stand out if you found this interesting and helpful support my work by liking this video and subscribing to my channel for more power bi tips and tricks Thanks for watching and see you in the next video. Bye.